The passage of the bill was secured to the presentation of the report of the Joint Committees on Public Accounts, Finance and Appropriation, Commerce and Cooperative, as well as Investment Monitoring and State Economic Planning. The bill is meant to sanitize the gaming and lottery business and activities in the state so as to ensure that the industry was regulated in line with international best practices. While deliberating on the bill, the Speaker of the House, Abraham Ngobere, said it was equally aimed at addressing leakages in the industry which would consequently lead to the increase in the revenue generated in the coffers of the bias state government Public Procurement Amendment 2022 and a given bill 2023 rules is intended to open new visa of revenue to the result for bias state we all know these revenues assist the prosperity government to Pursue vigorously the development in the state as evident in the many roads, bridges, and educational facilities in place. The public recommend Amendment B. In essence, it is subject to periodic upward review by the State Council on Procurement from time to time. Thus, we have just done what the Constitution requires of us as a parliamentarians. I sincerely appreciate your understanding the efforts and thoughtfulness towards the both things we have positively considered today. The State Assembly is winding up to the close in a matter of a day, and I cannot thank you enough for the support over the period. The confidence you have in me is a waste of It is my belief that the love and understanding we share will translate into a lifetime relationship. We do sincerely appreciate your attention to your contributions. The House was later adjourned till the next sitting day. From the Bassa State House of Assembly, Baratwai Pre Awi, NTA News.